Hello everybody, I'm Conquering History Games and welcome back to part 24 of my St. Thomas's Dream campaign here in Crusader Kings 2. So in the last episode we finally forged a bloodline. Not the best bloodline or, you know, it's a pretty, it's a good bloodline, but not the one that I had been hoping for. But that's okay, that's what future generations are for after all. Although it's going to have to take some sort of coincidence where we get uh, young ones again. Oh shoot, I just realized this is a patrilin... Oh, wait. Yeah, this is a patrilineal inheritance bloodline, and my heir is a woman. It's fine. We've got a couple of boys. We can we can probably you know we, we, and divine marriage is not just not frowned upon. It's it's condoned. It's encouraged. So we can work it out. Uh, so we're still in the middle of fighting these wars of the holy wars up here in the northeast on the northeast borderlands of our country. Uh, Kingdom of Gujarat has drifted into has yeah has drifted out of Rajasthan. Uh, all right, we took this time to come on over here, and where are my retinue? Here, let's start to sort of bring them into this direction. Nestorians again. By the way, I'm very aware that there are easier ways to get this uh, St. Thomas achievement, probably by if you just take Sri Lanka and stay there, hang out there for a million years, or not even that long. You could probably convert the whole island pretty quickly if you wanted to play a game like that, but I'm, you know, I'm trying to see if I could do the entire uh, subcontinent, ideally. It's okay, though. It's all good. You guys are putting up a heck of a fight, though. I will give them that. What, where, where did I just lose? What? Oh shoot, we lost here. Oh, those river cr crossing penalties—they can—they uh, can stack up on you if you're not careful. But that's okay. We've got our war elephants, and uh, we can—we can work it out. Now, after this, uh, we're probably going to have to take a little bit of time to let my vassals cool off for a while. Do I even want to bother with building more castles right now? Or temples? I should probably save it for a future... Yeah, for a future heir of mine so I can try to go for the bloodline again. Uh, so I guess we will... What are we going to do? Oh, I didn't realize I had this many... Um... What? Oh, that's the kingdom. Okay. No. Wait, which Raj is this? It's this one, right? Yeah. Okay, there. He's good. Cool. Uh, what I was going to say is, yeah, the future we might try to do the bloodline again with a guy. So I guess whatever my current... My current things... My current heir's grandchild. That's going to be the key, is what I'm saying. Oh, he does have the Valiant Blood. Okay. All right, because she's in a matrilineal marriage, my Bailey is. So that, okay, everything's all good then. All right, this is done. We caught the capture. We got the capture, is what I meant to say. Also usurp that title. We are definitely going to do that. Fantastic stuff. Uh, Kalampur, this revolt is still going on. What a complete and total mess this is. More Nestorian uprisings. See if I don't have enough shit going on in my life. Okay, got some more Rajas. Read that. Oh, who who has this? What is this du jour part of? Ah, this woman. Who is imprisoned. Can I revoke her title? I forget. No. That's a big minus 30. How did I end up imprisoning her? Well, here's what we're going to do. We're just going to bypass her, go down to my heir's heir, and uh, give one of them this kingdom. Yeah. Enjoy it, kid. Alright. Now, uh, I think a couple more holdings besieged here, and we'll be good to go. China just keeps declaring war on these tiny little chiefs in uh, Central Asia as if that's a good use of their time. Oh, and I guess one of my vassals took care of the Nestorians. Thank you. Appreciate that. Uh, okay, we've got the Absolute Cognatic. Hmm. Let's 
still only 97 and 100. Great. What the heck? Why don't we have this? Is it independent? Whatever. It don't matter to me what you're saying. Da, 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 da. Will not become my vassal. And we have strengthened the Messalian religion. All right, fantastic. So that puts us up to 43%. Uh, could still try to do the ambition to have a son, but no, that's not going to happen because my. Well, I can't cancel it now. It doesn't matter. Uh, let's get given some. creating some vassals out here. Okay. Is there any others? Uh, yes, right here. Anybody else? Oh, a lot of empty holdings in this area. Looks like the Buddhists weren't building very much, playing wide instead of tall. Uh, it's still a little bit too much. Let's again go to the grandkids, give them something. So this is the jour part of uh, Jahar Khan. Ooh, I think I already give that gave that away, or did I? No, I didn't. Okay, great. So we can give it to him, including all the lower titles. We're square. Great, and then um, my other one of my grandsons, I will give these areas. Yeah. No, 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 no. There we go. Okay, luckily the game stopped me from making that mistake. Do we have... Do, do, has this duchy been created yet? I'd have to usurp it, but they're at war right now. Alright. Who are they at war with? Host, oh, with a host war kind of thing. Bodyguard lover. Ooh, good for him. Okay, I think we could take this one vassal here. And, uh... So, if I wanted to... Not that I am, but if I wanted to declare war on the Caliph... We could do a great conquest. It is time to show them who is the strongest... By spending a significant amount of prestige and piety, we can do good war for an entire kingdom as long as they're as strong as you are stronger. And I will vassalize everything that's held in uh, in this kingdom. So this is not like an invasion where I'm going to take everything occupied. Uh, yeah, because they have at least 200 counties, right? Yeah, they got 273. They got way more than that. Uh... So we could, we it doesn't look like we could do a religious liberation though. I thought that was uh, something I could do, but I guess not. But if I just check some of these other areas, there's border disputes. I don't see anything though about a religious liberation. You know what though, there is a bloodline um, that can give us that. I don't remember how to get it though. Uh, I, by the way, we're not going to be able to get the blood of Ahsoka because um, we're not of an Eastern religion, and I'm pretty sure we have to be. All right, so we have a zeal bloodline. Only active if you follow the founder's religion. These are uh, these are event change event chains. See, I don't know how to do that. Uh, I'm trying to check in the other monitor right now. Hmm. Your piece hybrid. Picking branches. <laughs> I don't know. Uh, this part of the wiki is uh, not all done anyway. <sighs> okay. It's fine. We can't depend on that. Uh. And I guess we could... Well, we're going to have to take a little bit of a break. Well, somebody's offering to go to the Tang Empire. Go right ahead. Uh, Okay, okay. Oh, we don't need to be on rulership anymore either. I think we're going to want to switch to theology. Or maybe I should just stay where I'm at. So then I could get the event that will ask me to do it. Or get the mission that asks me to do that. I also got to donate to charity again soon. Still trying to kill this fool. It ain't happening. 
what we the least we could do is take this small county over here just gonna get in posi position all right it's de jour ours no need to or do we want to make it a holy war yeah let's do a holy war for the moral authority this will be very quick I think uh, there's no, I don't think the the others will be able to come down in time before I could take all of their holding all these holdings because they've only got two of them Rowena prospers. I am great. Get a glorious monument, giving the following effects. Monthly prestige plus half a percent. Oh, but that's a great work, isn't it? Or no? Oh, shoot. Why did I think this was a uh, great work? See, I'm a religious champion. That's not the same, though. Uh, their K okay, the carriage is about to kill the dude. Nice, nice, nice. Uh, success. He was in it. He is done. That is finished. Okay, now who else is being a problem in my realm? Alcapura. That's a that's a food. I think. Let me check that out. Or, yeah, it's like a yeah, it's a Caribbean food. There's this uh, sandwich place in um, here in El Paso that makes good Caribbean food, so I'm pretty familiar with it. Yeah. Oh, now I'm craving alcapurias, even though they're super duper unhealthy. <laughs> they're, they're fried. Basically, they're it's fried. It's fried food, but it's something that people would. I'm sure a doctor would say maybe you should just eat a corn dog because it would be healthier. Let's see, poor weather and impenetrable language barrier. Oh no, what? I lost Grace now. What the fuck? Ah, uh, gonna pay tribute of some kind. So I could basically trigger an invasion at will right now. Do I want to break up the Muslims? Or is Tibet gonna be the bigger problem? Not sure. It's just the damn moral authority, you know what I mean? Maybe I could do something where... Hmm... Maybe I can conquer my way east to the holy land, or to, to the holy sites, leave some Nestorians in charge, and then just grant them independence. Because you could do that. Like, like if I go to, uh, say, this guy. Or no, it has to be a direct vassal. Okay, yeah, so, so like her. Uh, Mahara Eo of Sindh. I could grant her independence if I wanted. Um, and so all that would have broken off. So it's it is an idea to move west and continuously. Well, not continuously, but I'd have to get all the way out to the holy sites. Yeah, so I'd have to I'd have to come up here, here, here. Yeah, Jer Jerusalem is considered one of them. So it's Jerusalem, Edessa, Baghdad, and Merv. Besides what I already got. So I have to go all the way to the freaking Mediterranean, basically. There's no short path there. It's one, two, three, four, five, six kingdoms I would have to take along the way and then release. And that would be the idea, too, is I'd want them to be Nestorian kingdoms. And they'd probably fall apart very quickly. All right, what's this guy want? Uh, he's into learning. And what's this? Matrilineal marriage. Uh, oh shoot, my chancellor just got busted. Hold on, damn it! Focusing on my duties, getting some learning. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, I can compose a book again. I think. Uh, yes, yes, I can. Ooh, that's fun. You know what? Let me borrow from the Jews because I, I ain't no spring chicken. Let's borrow from the Jews so I can get that done quickly. Or get started on that now. Because I still have to live to be about what, 60, into my 60s. So, compose a book. Uh, Something to honor God or something educational, right? I did, do I already have like a following God thing? No, we have History of Armor. Specul speculum regal and the codex thomas so we'll do the to honor god or something education terrific now we've got to pay back the jews but it's given me a head start on starting that 
Uh, ba -ba 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 Let's try to get some pain going on in there. Oh, shoot! Need a little bit of reinforcements. Oh, no, no, these guys are at 100%. That was close. I was blue it on this floor. Alright. Cool, so we cleaned up that little pocket. And we won another Holy War, which is terrific, because now we're up to 48. I think we have to get over 50%. Uh, cool, I'm no longer stressed. Uh, while I still have the rulership thing, that's even better. Uh, so I think if we win... I'm trying to remember how to trigger the Holy Orders, because I don't know if the Holy Orders... I don't know if it's that you have to have moral authority over a certain amount in order to get the ones that the Nestorians have. And plus, I'm technically... Well, I'm a Reformed Heresy, now I'm the majority, but... Uh, the Nestorian branch of Holy Knights, I don't know if, it's, if if they're available yet. I don't know if it's a case of I have to get my moral authority up, or if it's a case of that I have to wait until a certain year to where, uh, you know, when, when they're doing the, uh, the Crusades and stuff. Alright, do we have any other small wars we can fight? Oh, this is a very, very tiny kingdom up here. I think my retinues can once again just deal with that on their own. Uh, no, actually not quite on their own. This this guy's kind of strong. How big is his land? How does he have so many people? It's just these three counties, uh, four counties, one, two, three, four. Oh, wait, no, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Oh, okay, so these guys broke off from the uh, Kyrgyz. Something like that. What have we got here? All right, we got an independent Punjab. Punjabi, Indo-Aryan. Let's come up here and deal with him. Oh, not a not a holy war though. We got to do a. Oh shoot it! It's gonna have to be a border dispute, huh? Ah. Because if I do a holy war, I kind of get the feeling he's gonna jump in to help. Shoot! All right, I need I need a holy war somebody. Is this uh, an independent realm? I can't declare war on him. Because I don't have anything valid, I don't border them. I actually can't go to war. Okay, I can go to war with the Paula. Uh, there's actually not too many that I border right now. <laughs> okay, this is bringing people into the center of uh, the land. Penance seems to be going well so far. Yeah. Making more progress. The Asceticus is truly a book of wonders. Oh, nice. I just saw that county convert. And my Chancellor is still trying to get Nelore to convert. We're having a bit of problems with it. Done. And I got the devotion. That puts me at over a thousand. Let's convert again. Uh, we got to start dealing with these uh, Buddhists up here. It adds up, little by little. I've become content again, which is fine, because I already have the bloodline. So I'm totally cool with that. Now we can usurp the Raj. So we were wanting to give this to my son, or grandson, I should say. Great. The Thomas clan is everywhere. How big is it these days? We've got 44 living members. Fantastic stuff. That's with divine marriages too, so sometimes the, the branches come back together. <laughs> Alright. Uh, moral authority though, 49%. I don't want to be a true... Then again, I can afford it, right? Being a truce breaker. 7,000 or so. Duh, we gotta... We gotta let the, the vassal thing tick down, because they're annoyed with me at the moment. He's embraced a heresy, demand reconversion, or engage him theological debate. The price of decadence, the ruling dynasty of the Umayyad Sultanate has been overthrown by the hard, zealous and hard living tribesmen of the Bembere dynasty. Their decadent sultanate has been toppled, bringing any vassals from their bondage to the unworthy sultan. With the sultanate gone, time will tell if a worthy dynasty will be up to the task of restoring authority to the region. But is Andalusia still ruled by the Umayyads? So there's a branch family still there. 
Nice. So my nephew saw the light. You know what it was? Because he wasn't in an incestuous marriage. He didn't realize the benefits of my brand of Christianity. <sighs> Alright, so we could do the... If I fight the Bengal, I need to... Whoops. I need to... Oh, wait, this won't be breaking a truce. This is a new guy. Okay, so we could... Uh... I want something where I'm bordering this one county. All right, Guada. This brings me all the way up to a border with Pala and with Sitia, which is a Manichaean-led uh, country. Very unusual, but it is part of Bengal. Okay, so that's what we're gonna try to do. We're gonna let's get my retinue in place, but. In a little bit here, let's let things tick down into the single digits. Hmm. There's some grizzly warriors or murders going on. Well, we're gonna we're gonna holy war them for this uh, for this duchy here, Gouda. That way, in the future, I can holy war Bengal, Pala, and Sutia all at once. I really want that holy order to be made. Uh, we got some info about this guy's sexual preferences. Okay, we're just gonna say, don't be in factions and it won't be a problem. Good. Oh, he's dead now. Died of stress. Okay. Hmm. Somebody's trying to kill me? Who would dare? I am the White Knight. My nephew is plotting. He's a title claimant. Well, nephew. One turn around deserves another, I suppose. Wait, no, this is my cousin. Where, where'd he go? That's under plot. So he's not even. Whatever. I'm gonna plot to kill him. Should not be too difficult, I think. Hmm, maybe it will be. Alright, let's go into hiding. I have to finish my book. Oh, but I just came back from hiding. Hmm, this is a pu a pickle. A pickle of puzzle. What am I supposed to do? Oh, uh, let's see. Time for a new bishopric. So, I think I said, did I say I was going to start going through the apostles? Saying, okay, we did, I know Paul wasn't an apostle, but okay, we did Peter and Paul. It's St. James. Start renaming these. Okay, and I have a couple cities that are personally mine that I don't need. Say la vie, as they say. Mayor seems like a decent person. Uh, okay, yeah, sure, a friend. It's fine to have a friend. What's this guy's deal? Wants control of the Raj of Anarta. Why? He has no claim to it. Where's... Where's Anarta? I don't even know where it is. He... Am I reading this right? Anarta. Uh, that is... Anarta. I'm not even sure where that is. I'm trying to look at his borders. See where... Narta. Oh, up here. So he has the kingdom of Masha uh, Russia Shim. Uh, Maharashtra. He wants. Yeah, Maharashtra is not de jure part of that. He just must have a holding somewhere in there. Oh, he does. He's not gonna get it. All right, we have more vassals who are just not getting with the program in terms of conversion. Let's see. Come on, buddy. Be cool. Be cool. Join the winning team. Still won't do it. Is a ruler brace reluctance? Those things do make it harder. Yeah, this guy's in two plots against me. 
Hmm. Oh, 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 what's... Okay, it's autosave. Alright. How's that last vessel levy ticking going? It's still at about minus 15. Looks like they're at war with somebody else, though. Defending in a holy war against Sutian. Oh, these two are fighting. Alright. Oh, that's uh, that's maintenance, so uh, I gotta get going. It's a short episode. I'll try to upload a second one today or something. You all have yourselves a great day. I'll see you later. Bye.